now just talking off off camera about you've just been overtaken in the Premier League goal scoring list. You were second behind Alan Shearer. Yeah. You're now third behind a certain Wayne Rooney. Been a difficult few weeks for England's leading record goal scorer and now the number two goal scorer in the Premier League. Um, you know him well. It's uh, it's been tough, isn't it? But he'll come through. It's, it's been very tough. But if you look at his career. Um, I think he's, he's always been questioned throughout his career and he's always come through and I, I, I can't see it changing, you know, I think uh, when he's just about to turn 31, I think people calling for his head saying he should retire and things like that, well, it's all about opinions, you know, I think he's, for England, he's been England's players for most probably the past, what, four or five years, for Manchester United, I mean, possibly, if you take away David De Gea being the best player for the past, what, three years, I think it is, I think it was Wayne. So you, you look at things like that. So I, I, I think, you know, he'll take it as a pinch of salt. He'll work extremely hard and get back to what he does best. And we're talking about you, Alan Shearer, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Wayne Rooney actually isn't a number nine, is he? He's not a classical goal scorer as such. He, he sits just behind. So his record's even phenomenal, even more phenomenal. He, he's, he's got a great record. Uh, he's the kind of guy who has played in every position for Manchester United. You know, he's asked to play left, left wing, right wing central midfield, up front by himself, and, and he's done that. And I think sometimes, you know, we don't look at that and say that's, that's a big factor in, in his career. But hey, that's what the media do. They're never going to look at things like that. I think they come to a stage where by the turn and say, oh, he can't do anymore. Let's get rid of him. But who are you going to replace him with first and foremost? You know, let's ask those questions. So we'll just have to wait and see.